Good morning, everybody. Admiral Preparedness here. Uh, it's official. We're now a Natick Research Labs male human guinea pig for the MRE study of 2016. This is going to be day one, Tuesday. Meals two and number 19. Total 2,600 calories. We have the um, good folks over there at the Natick have gone ahead and prepared the meal for me already. All I have to do is open it up and pick out the items. One thing I want to stress is these meals are definitely the ones that the guys out there in the field are eating in Afghanistan and other places around the country and world, of course. Uh, let's take a look at what we got here just to give you all a good idea what this is going to be like. This is day one of 21 days. These are the actual warfighter meals, as you can see. They want me to keep everything. Don't throw anything away. This is basically the grading, what's, what the meal is, the caloric intake for each day, each meal. There's no breakfast, so you got to kind of take what's in these packages and create your breakfast. I've documented it as well, so I've got my record of it. And uh, let's see what they gave us. Okay. For meal number two, which is this one right here, you've got your beef shredded in barbecue sauce. And they took away the MRE heater since we don't need those. And so, of course, the standard MRE package. Being a Maraquil, the manufacturer of Maraquil, you have your inner bag. And so what comes with this guy, of course, you've got your MRE beverage bag. I don't know why they kept that in there. They should have took that out also because, you know, I'm at home. I'm, I'm going to be eating these guys every day. And so I don't have a problem with using other containers. So that'll be fine, but I'm not going to use it. So they'll just get that back. Of course, you're going to have your... Uh, caloric intake cards. I'm not going to use these either. I don't need to. So those will go put those get put back away. What they do is they weigh these before they give them to me so they know exactly what the weight was. Now the MRE spoon, I'm not going to use either because I have my own utensil, so that just gets to stay. The accessory pack, I've already opened this one up to see what's in it. Now these are all supposedly 2014 uh, preparation, so we'll, we'll just go ahead and go by that. But it's obviously... 13, 2013, 317th day of that year. Uh, the moist towelette, I, I've got my own utensils at home, so I don't need to worry about that. I'm not much of a, a gum chewer, but you know what? I'm going to go ahead and give these guys a good shot. I don't have a problem with that. The toilet paper, I'm just going to leave that alone. We don't need that. We've got plenty of that at the house. They won't. I'm, I'm going to ask them if I can keep it afterward, but I don't know if they'll let me. You have the iodized salt. That's pretty interesting. That's for the food. Uh, instead of sugar, this is a substitute, Splenda. There's the uh, freeze-dried instant coffee, okay, in your standard generic type packaging. Uh, the non-dairy creamer product. For your drink, it's a lemonade-flavored, no fruit juice, so it's pretty much artificial everything. Now what I'll do with these guys here, the uh, this is the cheese spread with jalapeno. Well, this guy here, I'll put that into some water to heat it up with the MRE. Uh, this one here is the beans, black beans seasoned in the pouch. Of course, this is date three three five three. You have you have the tortillas. Now these are always good if you want to heat them in the water. Get them nice and warm before you open them because they won't split on you. They're notorious for doing that. And, of course, you have the uh, main entree, I believe, here. This is the shredded beef in your retort package. And the date on this one is, uh, it's hard to see because the light in here is terrible. Uh, looks like 2014-083. 2014, the 83rd day of that year. Of course, now you've got these guys here. There's no date on them, 
the cashews jalapeno flavored. There's no date. Uh, I couldn't find anything on it. I looked real hard, but then again, I saw up in the corner, there's a date code. So that date code is 3296. So that's the 296th day of the month here. Then you've got your pretzel sticks. I'm not much into pretzel sticks, but I'll go ahead and give these guys a munchie. Just put them out and munch on them all day long. Their date's also around 2013, uh, 2014, the ninth day. So these are the only fresh items of this entire group. About two and a half years old, three years old. Uh, the barbecue sauce, I'm not sure I'm going to use that at all either, but uh, you know, I want to use it because it's uh, got a storage date also of 2013. I want to see what this, how this stuff holds up. Uh, apparently, these are being kept in a, a, a storage closet there at the facility, and uh, that's interesting that they're not. It's not frozen or it's not kept in a environmentally controlled space as far as that goes. But this is what uh, is in that menu. Okay, now we're back. Well, menu, as a magic of science here, meal number 19 has already been opened up, of course. Uh, it's a Maraquil. Again, once again, it's a Maraquil. Now, this one's got some things that are different. This has the uh, chocolate chip cookie, which is going to be, a, we'll call that dessert, for whichever meal I decide to use it. Once again, you have uh, your accessory pack, and this one's pack number B, which is the 30, 2013, 318th day. You've got your uh, lip beverage pack, raspberry, which is a standard for that guy. Of course, your chiclets, and then your a little bit different. Uh, these are new. These are different. Now, I, I, these are interesting. Uh, they've been putting in these uh, Heinz ketchup and mustard uh, prepared packaging uh, with a shelf life uh, who knows I mean as long as you take care of it but these again were packaged back in 2013 the 211th day for the mustard and the 266th day for 2013 and then of course the cheese spread again we like cheese spread so this is going to go over well we just want to make sure we heat it up because it's kind of semi-solid right now once you put it in some water and heat it it'll be okay uh, another good item in here would be the uh, wheat snack bread. I think this is two pieces of this wheat snack bread. We'll have to open it up and see. But I, this is what you're going to use the cheese bread for. And I think this one here is the meat the patty. Yes. So what you're going to want to do is put the beef patty with the bread, with the ketchup and the mustard, and make like a sandwich. So we'll go ahead and try that too, just for flavor. Now, these guys here, I think everybody really likes these guys. These are the cocoa beverage powder mix. Uh, I'm not going to worry about mixing them inside the container since I have a house that I'm living in. So that'll be fun to watch. Again, you have your Miracle style container. That's the inner bag. We'll keep we'll keep that up for the garbage. We're going to tell us not to throw anything away. And uh, this is a little treat, though. I've had these before. The cherry ra blueberry raspberry or blueberry cobbler. Uh, this is really good. It's got some pieces of... Uh, the actual cobbler material, uh, really nice and sweet. Uh, really, you, you can have it cold or you can have it warm. Uh, since uh, there are other menus that they've given me for the last for the next four days, I may experiment a little bit with some of those ingredients to see if we can get this guy to even be better. But alone, it's perfect. I'll probably just eat it right out of the container once I heat it up. Well, that's it for now for that. We'll get back to you in just a little bit. Uh, again, this is a... Admiral Preparedness, MRE, 21 day, only eat MREs only, and drinking water, nothing else other than what the beverages they give me.